Hey Leo, welcome to my channel. This is going to be a love reading for the sign of Leo. So if you're Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, or if you have a stellium in Leo, this reading is going to be for you. Keep in mind, this is going to be a general reading, so it might not resonate with everyone. If it doesn't, let it fly. Don't try to force on its edge. Also, don't let this reading take anything from you. Now, if you do resonate with this reading, please consider subscribing to my channel and liking this video. Also, keep in mind, energy is fluid, rose can get reversed, so take how it resonates. Page of Pentacles. Okay. Five of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles. Queen of Swords. Hmm. Two of Wands. Ooh, two of Cups. of swords, ace of cups, okay, the empress, and the ten of cups, so that is good, this is good, what of the deck, we have uh, six of cups here, so this person really is missing you, they have feelings for you, two of cups, ace of cups, ten of cups, this person has feelings for you. But the problem here is this person has not expressed their feelings in the past. For some of you, this person could have just uh, left you behind. You felt very left behind by this person here, for some of you. It's also very possible uh, this person had some past baggages, some past experience, you know, uh, something that was really bothering them, still haunting them. This person hadn't moved on from that. For some of you, you met this person when you, this person was going through some sort of healing as well here. You could have helped in this person's healing process one way or other. And that's the reason why this like there's this blockage here. You could also be dealing with someone who, who is, you know, they, are, they were not ready to leave the past in the past. They were not ready to um, leave the past package. They were not ready for a new beginning. This person could have been stuck in their comfort zone for some of you as well here. Yeah. So almost like even though this person did have feelings and everything, they did never express their feelings to you. Right now, this person really feels very left out in the cold and miserable and alone and lonely. For some of you, you could have been the one who disconnected from this person or this connection. And the reason you did that is because no offer was being made here. So why should you remain just stuck in a connection that is you're not getting what you deserve. You're not getting what you truly want. If you're not getting that, why should you remain stuck in that connection? That could have been the thing here as well. For some of you, you could have been disconnected. You could have been the one who walked away, who disconnected, who took a step back from this person here. It's also very possible the Ace of Cups here. You were the one who was uh, who offered your cup of love to this person first. And this person that just, you know, like... Uh, because you were the one who was offering your cup of love to this person. This person could have taken that for granted here. They might not have appreciated you. This person could have, might have, uh, sorry. This person could be very possible that they didn't appreciate you. They didn't appreciate a love. They didn't appreciate you when they had you. When you were giving to this person. They didn't appreciate you back then. You could have been the one to express your feelings first in this connection. But they do have feelings with the two of cups here. They do have feelings. They might not have expressed it in the past. Or it's very possible this person might not have even realized that they did have these strong feelings for you. But now they do. And for some of you, you had to be the one to walk away from this person or this connection for them to realize this. This person could be feeling like they, they are manifesting some sort of communication here. That's what this person is trying to do.
फोर ऑफ कप्स इन रिवर्स सेवन ऑफ पेंटिकल्स सेवन ऑफ पेंटिकल्स थ्री ऑफ पेंटिकल्स या फोर ऑफ कप्स इन रिवर्स दिस पर्सन इज ट्राइंग टू थिंक लेस ओवर थिंक लेस एंड टेक सम एक्शन दैट्स व्हाट द एनर्जी हियर इज विद दैट फोर ऑफ कप्स इन रिवर्स हियर थ्री एंड सेवन ऑफ पेंटिकल्स वी ऑलरेडी हैव द सेवन एंड थ्री ऑफ पेंटिकल्स four of pentacles in the mix so someone was holding back this person was holding back from expressing themselves they were holding back from giving to this connection from collaborating with you growing this connection taking it somewhere but now this person feels sad lonely miserable without you they feel very very isolated they feel very left out in the cold like they are alone in this and now they want a blissful relationship a blissful connection now they want the empress They want to feel good again. They want to feel abandoned again. This person has had a lot of clarity as well here. They have had a lot of clarity. So for some of you, this person wants to collaborate. Whatever they didn't do in the past that they should have done, this person wants to do all of that now because oh, now they realize your value. now they understand what wrong they were doing in the past again at the bottom of this deck we already had the six of cups at the bottom of this deck right and then we had the six of cups here so someone really really misses you they feel a connection with you here they they know very very clearly that there is a connection here this person is very aware of it two of cups six of cups ace of cups ten of cups you could be dealing with a water sign pisces cancer scorpio or a taurus libra we also have the page of pentacles a lot of pentacles as well So you could be dealing with an Earth sign as well, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We don't have much major arcana here except the Empress. So yeah, King of Wands. Yeah, this is someone who wants to take action. Especially if this is another Fire sign or an Air sign, this person really wants to take action here. They have a, had a lot of clarity, and whatever clarity this person has had, they sort of understand that you know, like they have to be the one to do anything here. you you could have set strong boundaries with this person but this is someone who's thinking they, this person understands the only way to approach you or on the only way to come towards you or even um make something happen here is if they directly approach you there's some direct communication that is needed from their side i don't know which card was in reverse here but okay Hmm. Five of Cups in Reverse and the Queen of Pentacles. Yeah. This person is a uh, Five of Pentacles and Five of Cups. They feel a lot of miserable energy here. This person feels a lot of miserable energy. For some of you, this person could be feeling a little bit pessimistic as well here. They're not trying to dwell in that pessimism though. even though this person feels very sad lonely or uh, miserable alone pessimism this person is trying not to dwell in that energy because they know they have to make some big decisions here for some of you this person is willing to travel to you as well here travel with you travel to you if you had any plans uh, like that this person is willing to do that they are willing to go to the go the distance for some of you here whatever that means in this in your particular scenario this person is willing to go the distance it's like someone who's understanding the value of um long term commitment as well
justice. Scales will be balanced again. We'll be dealing with the Libra. This is the second major arcana here. What is this? The star in reverse. Again, another major arcana. Yeah, bottom of the deck is two of swords. I'm the emperor here. You could be dealing with an Aries, Aquarius. Suddenly we have a lot of major arcanas, three major arcanas here. You could be dealing with Libra, Aquarius, Aries. Yeah, two of swords. This person is in that energy of back and forth. There's a back and forth energy with this person. So again, that energy of, they're trying to keep that hope alive here. This is what this person is trying. They're trying to keep the hope alive. It's not like this person has a lot of hope. They're very positive, but they are trying their best to be positive in whatever mental or emotional state they are in because five of pentacles, five of cups energy, right? So five of pentacles here, five of cups. So mentally and emotionally, when it comes to the thoughts and when it comes to the heart, this person is not that positive. But this person wants to be hopeful about the situation. They're trying. Occasionally, this person is in that energy with the two of swords. Maybe, maybe Leo will not welcome me. Maybe Leo doesn't care. So again, two of swords, a bit of an overthinking is happening for this person here. For some of you, it's also very possible this person has been overthinking. They did overthink in the past. And they did feel hopeless, but at the same time, this person understands that there's no point just sitting there feeling hopeless and doing nothing. They have to do something. Sitting there and doing nothing and feeling hopeless, that's not going to change anything. I mean, they do have a lot of feelings for you with the two of cups. Yeah. Death is in reverse here. So this person was... They were afraid of some sort of change. They were afraid of, um, you know, letting the past be in the past, releasing the past baggage, some sort of transition, some sort of moving forward. This person was afraid of it. Some sort of change here. Something they needed to release that they were holding back from releasing. Some transformation that needed to happen in this person. Wow. Age of Swords in reverse and the High Priestess in reverse. Could be dealing with the Pisces Cancer. Hmm. so again page of swords in reverse someone was not communicating there was for some of you there was no approach from this person's side there was no movement from this person's side whatever approach there was uh, you were the one who was approaching the situation was trying to make things work was trying to uh, make sure that this connection moves forward moves further you were the one who was putting in all the effort Whereas this person, for some of you, they could have lied to you as well. There could have been lies. There could have been secrets. For some of you, as I said, this person didn't appreciate you at all. Like you were offering your cup of love to this person, but they were just rejecting that outright. try to understand you as well here they didn't they didn't understand you or they didn't try to understand you it's like someone who was who was stuck in their ways that's the problem with this person yeah there was no equal give and take in the situation six of pentacles there was no equal give and take for some of you you could have been the one who was over giving to the situation or connection and this person did not appreciate that Even though you were overextending yourself, they were not appreciating you. Oh, 
Oh wow, look at that. I was trying to clarify the Ace of Cups. We have the Ace of Cups clarifying the Ace of Cups. That's a double confirmation. This person's heart wasn't open and they were not ready to take that leap of faith. They were not ready to take the risk here. You could have, you were coming from a very authentic place. You wanted to take that leap of faith. You wanted to move forward. But this person was not in the energy of moving forward at all. They were not ready to open their heart. They were not ready to take that leap of faith. But you completely, you could have blindly trusted this person for some of you, the Ace of Cups and the Fool. For some of you were very naive and did not see through the uh, see what this person's intentions were. You didn't not see, you didn't understand. You would have really trusted this person because you have a lot of feelings for them, right? So of course you will trust them. Yeah. Seven of Swords at the bottom of the deck. You blindly trusted this person. And that backfired. This, for some of you, this person was not ready to let go of the deceptive energies. Yeah, Ten of Cups. They were not ready to let go of the deceptive energies. For some of you, there was breadcrumbing. There were uh, this person. There was unequal give and take. This person was giving to another situation. For some of you, eight of pentacles six of swords you already have the eight of pentacles at one point and there we have the six of swords here so yeah eight of pentacles eight of wands someone wants to communicate someone wants to talk because they want to have a new beginning with you they want to have a relationship they are willing to put in the effort this person is act like they want to tell you they are willing to put in the effort can you see that yes they are willing to put in the effort they are willing to move things forward here they're willing to start fresh for some of you. Again, the Six of Cups, again, at the bottom of the deck. But literally, the Six of yeah, six of Cups and Judgment. Someone really wants another chance with you. Someone who was refusing to carry the weight of this connection, refusing to give to this connection, invest in this connection. They want another chance because they really, really miss you. We saw the Six of Cups thrice here. And the Judgment. It's difficult to communicate with you. I feel misunderstood. We did have the page of swords in reverse. So there was communication problem in this connection. It's very possible. Uh, like you both. There was a lot of misunderstanding in this connection. Yeah. I keep dabbing into unhealthy addictions to deal with my pain. I want you to be available even if I am not. So you were the one who was more available than this person. More giving to this person. I have children you do not know about. So as I said, there was unequal give and take. This person was giving to two situations. There could be baby daddy or baby mama sort of a situation here as well for some of you. It doesn't have to be for everyone, but could be a confirmation for some of you. I'm having unhealthy attachments and obsessions, of course. I'm completely loyal to you. I'm not interested in anyone else. This person, loyalty could have been a big deal in this connection. Oh, my spiritual, this is surprising. My spiritual awakening is painful and I'm confused on what to do. Yeah, this person could be going through a huge change here. And that's the reason why this person wants to fix things. They want to approach you. Because this is someone I was actually changing. We did have the judgment at the bottom of the deck, right? Six of Cups and judgment, yeah. And Six of Cups, funny enough, Six of Cups also has children, also has kids. So could be kids involved here in this connection. I regret not being able to appreciate uniqueness and individuality. So yeah, you felt very unappreciated by this person. I'm sorry for the times I was controlling and manipulative. I'm sorry for the times I was distant and uninvolved in our relationship. Yeah, this person was very distant. And that could be because other people were involved in this connection or something like that. I'm sorry for the times I was defensive and argumentative. So a lot of fights and arguments could have happened. I regret not being able to prioritize a relationship and broke your trust, but I want to apologize and make amends. Yes, this person wants to apologize and make amends. 
Well, that's your reading, Leo. I hope you found some clarity through this reading. I'll see you guys in your next reading. Until then, take care, guys. Bye-bye.